To get started with the school-wide goose chase activity, make sure you've downloaded the app. After you've downloaded and installed the app, go to your launcher or device and open up the app. Once you're signed in and you've allowed permission for the app, you'll search for the game and you'll type in the game code. If the game code has changed, be sure to check the slideshow for an up-to-date game code. Now it will say when it has started and when it will end. You or your students will select their team and join their game. Teams are set up by homeroom teachers for in-person and remote classrooms. Once they've clicked on their teacher, you can see a list of all the different activities that are here. We can see the questions and how many points. Nothing has been completed. There are different types of questions. There are ones that would require a text, and there are ones that require you to post a picture. There are about 40 different activities for you to engage your students with for Hour of Code this year. There are some others that might have links. For example, if we click on the Flipgrid activity, you will see that there is an attached link which would open up another resource. Coders that read, that activity will open up, have a link that will take the students to Epic Reading Library that I have created for coding and computer science. Some of them, you'll just need to take a picture of, say, your coders doing their coding. And we can click on Snap Evidence, and we can use our camera to take that picture. You can also have them use the video and create a video. And it could be the video of them talking about what they're coding, or how they broke out of the breakout EDU game, and also, them working on their coding or you working with them. So go ahead, have fun with the goose chase this year for our hour of code event. Take some time to spread it out over the course of an entire week or within a day and see how many points you can get this year in our goose chase. I'll be checking this goose chase frequently uh, for your results and checking on the stats of your submissions.